should be done. Collect my equipment. Knock, mm -hmm. knock, knock. Hi, can I come in? Sure. Thanks. Hi, my name is Robin. I'm your student nurse assistant for today. Is it okay if I check your ID, Ben? Hi, Miss Stone. How are you doing? I am here today to clean your private area. Is that okay? Because if you come in and say, I'm going to do perineal care, they're going to go, huh? Welcome. <laughs> I thought we were allowed to say perineal care. You are allowed to say perineal care, but try and speak to the resident like they are like they understand you. Yeah, okay? You can, you can so I'm going to close the curtain. I'm going to move these things so I can walk around a little bit, okay? So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to put the barrier on here. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to take all of your equipment out. Okay, you can put the bath blanket right here. And so we have two washcloths, a hand towel, some soap, and another barrier, okay? All right, so, okay, I'm going to raise the bed up. Did you have a good breakfast today? Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Whatever. All right, so I'm gonna uncover her arm. Okay, I'm gonna get some warm water, okay, and then once you test it, all right? So I'm gonna warm water, a warm water before I put the side rail down, because I'm gonna turn away from her, I don't want her rolling out and mm -hmm. ruining my day. Okay, so warm water. Your whole gonna, career. Huh? Your whole career could just roll I know. Okay, is that warm enough? Yes. Good, excellent, okay. So now I'm gonna put it here, and then I am going to be working with her now, so I'm gonna put the side rail down. Now, you'll see in your script that there's a particular way, and you don't have to do it this way, diamond okay? Shape. But I put the bath blanket on in a diamond shape, okay? So I go that way, and then I got a point down here, and a point on this side, and then a point up here. But we're gonna fold this part down, and we're gonna ask her, can she please hold this while I remove the top sheet? Okay, you don't have to take it all the way off, just fan fold it or roll it down to the end of the bed. Okay? All right. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this, the end point down in between her legs like this. Now I'm gonna ask her, cause we're gonna ask her, even though I'm doing it for her, cause it's on a mannequin. I say, okay, can we um, bend your knees for me? Excellent. Now, here's what we do. And the reason I do this is because it's a mannequin, okay? Mannequin legs do not stay put. Hmm. I'm just gonna tell you that right now. Okay. So you go like this, you can either go in front of or mm -hmm. behind the ankle and put her foot on it, okay? And then you're gonna do the same thing to the other side. You're gonna ask her to bend her knee, come around and put her foot on it. And now her legs, now her legs are gonna stay like that. Cause we're working in here, we're working on a mannequin and mannequins are notoriously uncooperative. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now I'm going to be getting in there. So I want to put on my first pair of gloves. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is I kind of fold it like this. So I'm gonna raise this up. Ooh, there she is. There she is. Okay, and we're gonna put this down under her bottom so that we're not gonna get the bed wet. Okay? Now, both washcloths go into the water. We can raise it up a little bit. It's always better if you have your work your stuff close to you. Yes. All right. So when we're not actually going in there, we're gonna keep her covered up because that's just dignity. Okay, so my first washcloth, soap. Now there's four strokes, okay? We're going to go across the top and then we're gonna peel. We're gonna go down one side, peel, 
down the other side peel and it's very important you have to verbalize i'm going to spread the labia okay that's just something you have to say okay because you they want to make sure that you clean actually inside too mm -hmm. so you verbalize i'm going to spread the labia and wash down the center okay mm -hmm. now i'm going to cover her up and i'm going to put the washcloth over here or hang it over the side whichever okay and then i'm going to rinse the same way okay across the top Peel one side, peel oh, other side, peel, spread the labia and down the center. All right, now you can put these in here and they're in a pat dry. Okay, keep this separate. Now I'm going to remove this. Save it though because we're going to use it again. Put it right here. Take off my gloves and then I'm going to have her put her feet down. Okay, so I'm going to put up the side rail. I'm going to verbalize because you really don't have to go out and get new water and stuff. But I'm going to turn away and verbalize that I'm getting fresh water and rinsing out the washcloths. Okay, I'm going to come back, have her check it. All right, now we're going to turn her on her side. Okay, so we can scoot her a little closer to us. Oops. Going to have her make a stop sign. And then we're going to roll her on her side. Okay, and sometimes, usually if you're doing this skill, it's you and the evaluator. You don't have a partner. Mm -hmm. Because Is it easier just to bend the knee to this one? Or? Yeah. Okay. So now I'm going to get back in there. Gloves on. We're gonna raise this a little bit, and oh look, she has a little bit of a rash. Okay, so now we're gonna put this up here because we want to keep the bed from getting wet. All right, so we're gonna take our first washcloth, doesn't matter which one, because they're clean, soap it up. Remember, we're gonna go from the vaginal area up the back because we're going from clean to dirty. Okay, so you're gonna go up one butt cheek, and then you're gonna peel. You know, up the other butt cheek, peel up the center, peel. And then if you want to have a fourth peel, you can say, I'm going to spread the butt cheeks and wide up the center. Okay. And then we're going to rinse the same way. One. And you don't have to count out while you're doing this. But you just need to show them. You just need to show them that you're going in the right direction and they're, you're using a clean um side side every time <coughs> mm -hmm. okay and so then we're gonna pat dry mm -hmm. are we gonna ask her or talk to her or anything yeah about we can the, talk to her no no the the sore in her back um yeah if if it has one this one i just know has one um you can ask her if it hurts um did she say no she says no Huh? Our residents not wear underwear? Usually our residents have a brief on. Mm -hmm. Or a diaper. Either way. We call them briefs for adults, not diapers. Okay, so now we're going to cover her back up. Remove this. How's that feel better? Yes. She changes her voice. Okay, roll it away from you. Mm -hmm. It goes into the hamper. Okay, make sure this is tucked in and all nice and neat and smooth. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then we're going to do our ABC. She's on a line that's good. Brakes are on. She has a call light. Bed's going down into the low position. All right, 
right, so the soap and the basin are her personal property. So I'm going to dump this, put the soap in here, and then because I don't have gloves on, you go under. Throw this away, move it over. Clean and return my equipment to the proper area. All right, Miss Jones, you call me if you need me. Open the curtain, lock out, wash my hands, record and report.